It was a decade personified by sartorial flair. From cut to creativity, there are some standout trends that truly defined the 1970s. Some of the grooviest jumpsuits ever made were worn by both men and women in the 70s. With legends like David Bowie leading the way. Bell bottoms, or flares, were the ultimate statement piece, made popular by the likes of ABBA, Cher and even Michael Jackson. When it came to flares, the frillier, wider and altogether more outrageous the better. The miniskirts of the swinging 60s were old news in comparison to the transparent clothing movement, pioneered in the 70s by the likes of Ozzy Clark and Yves Saint Laurent. Wearing a see-through dress with no undergarments was certainly a statement. And this 70s model showed us that with any sheer garment, the most important accessory was a sassy attitude. If you're going to be afraid and wear it, what people are going to think, don't bother. Wear a turtleneck. If you're going to wear a topless dress, then put it on and forget about it. Platforms are the most iconic pieces of footwear of the decade, if not the 20th century. This glam rock footwear encouraged gender politics after both men and women chose to wear the height-boosting shoes. Gone are the pre-lib days when you would be two or three inches taller than your girlfriend. Well now, Mr. Figgin's shoe shops are striking a blow for men's lib by introducing a shoe with a five-inch cork sole, which will enable you to regain your rightful place. And whilst attitudes have shifted since then, there's one unmistakable look that has barely changed since it came screaming into the limelight in the 1970s. Inspired by the anarchic underworld inhabited by the likes of the New York Dolls, the Ramones and the Sex Pistols, punk exploded onto the scene in the 70s with leather-clad mohawked youths using safety pins like no generation before. Perhaps the biggest testament to the 1970s fashion is the way it's continued to inspire us, even decades later.